Hi, and welcome to Sony Learn TV. Today we're going to be talking about Sony's Vegas video and audio editing application. Vegas is one of the world's leading video and audio editing suites. It's suitable for virtually everyone, from professionals through to mum and dad recording little Johnny's first steps. Vegas is available in two versions, Movie Studio and what we're looking at today, Vegas version 7. With Vegas, you can capture from virtually any camera and output to virtually any file format or device. Today, we're going to demonstrate how Vegas copes with Sony's latest high definition video cameras. Vegas is designed to be the perfect complement to your HD Handycam. Not only does it natively support video formats like HDV, but with the latest update, it is also the first professional quality AVC HD editing solution. So, let's get started. First, we need to fire up Vegas. As you can see, Vegas supports some great features, such as the ability to use a second monitor or even a TV as preview display. If you've used other video editing applications, you'll probably have been frustrated by things like having to first import all your video clips into your project before you can use them. You'll find Vegas has a much simpler workflow. Because it supports virtually all video, audio, and digital still image formats, you can simply drag all your media directly into the timeline. Whether it's on your computer hard drive, an external hard drive, USB thumb drive, digital camera, or even optical disc. But I'm getting ahead of myself. As you'll be aware, you do still need to first ingest, that's just a fancy word for capture, video if you're using a tape based camera. Vegas 7 supports native HDV capture and editing. The advantage of this is performance. You can work with high definition HDV video on many computers just as easily as working with regular standard definition footage, such as from mini DV tape. Capturing video is simply a matter of plugging in your iLink or Firewire cable into your computer and selecting Capture in Vegas. When you capture video off a tape based camera, it's a real time process. But thanks to the magic of TV, I'm going to save you the wait. Okay, now we've captured the video, we can put it straight onto our timeline. While that's optimizing the audio, we'll show you how easy it is to work with AVC HD footage. We're using a hard disk drive model here, connected via its Handycam station. So it's simply a matter of navigating to the correct folder on the drive and dragging the raw video files directly onto the timeline. This one's a Dolby Digital Surround Sound recording. So you'll see we can easily adjust the pan of each of the six individual audio channels. For what we're doing today, however, we only need stereo audio. So I'm gonna let Vegas down convert it. Okay, so now we've got our video into Vegas, we can get into the nitty gritty of actual editing, but this is gonna require me to get in a bit closer. Hmm, that's better. Right, so Vegas supports unlimited audio and video tracks. That's all these things. With Vegas, you can do cool things like create professional sounding music beds using a huge range of available audio loops. Whoa! Vegas also works happily with all sorts of video on the same timeline. You can use high definition, standard definition, 24 frames, 60 fields, you name it. A huge range of effects also offers everything from color correction or mistake through to advanced compositing and chroma key work. 
Vegas is also supplied with a large range of video and audio effects to get you started. With these, you can create scrolling credits, you can make your video look like film, and much more. And of course, there's the transitions. To get me from here, to here, to here. You can even create your own. Finally, they do say what happens in Vegas stays in Vegas. Now that's not strictly true with Sony's Vegas. In fact, video that starts in Vegas can end up anywhere. So there it is, Sony's Vegas at a glance. Now if you'd like to try a copy for yourself, there's a free trial available at sonycreativesoftware.com. Otherwise, we'll see you next time on Sony Learn TV.